What's going on guys? This is Logan with West Desert Wheeler and out in the middle of the desert we found a bunch of pirates. What's going on guys? So we've got Connor, Steve, and Christian out here from Rock Pirates RC. They came down for the North vs South uh, finals and uh, now we're out here playing in Sand Hollow. I'm going to show these guys one of my favorite trails which is Mousetrap. You guys have all seen it but we're going to see how their pirate wagons do in there. So this one, always an interesting side hill. Sometimes I make it, sometimes I don't. Today might be the don't. But we're going to do our best to make it. There it is. I think we're going to be all right. Just got to watch that rear and don't let it slip all the way off. It's going to grab and go right there. And we're side hilled through. Obstacle number one. So Connor is running a base camp here and these guys are running their prototype shock towers soon to be available to everyone for the SCX 10-3 lineup. Don't buy them. Also got some <laughs> Rock Pirates RC sliders. <laughs> this one's tricky, it really is. I have trucks of my own that don't make this, so. That's a bone stock truck too. They haven't even tuned the shocks on it yet. Right, yeah. This base camp, newly, re newly released. Already getting parts out available for it. Okay, base camp's taking a bypass on the first obstacle, which just means he's moving it by hand. <laughs> so this is an element-based truck. This is Steve's power wagon, element axles, element chassis. Rock Pirates makes parts for axial, element, Traxxas, Vanquish, uh, we're in trouble once your rear drops. I'm in trouble. <laughs> it's really paying attention to the small details on that side hill of just getting your tire to hold onto the little ledges. Those cap racks will really help with that side hill too. Mm -hmm. That's, that is one part of it. My truck's quite a bit wider. Yeah, go straight right there. Keep going right there. Keep it coming. I think it's going to get it. We maybe wiggle your servo just a little to bring your front end down as you're, you're side hilling a little more than you need to. Yeah, there you go. Bring it on forward. That upper tire is barely hanging on. There she goes. All right. The pearl. The pearl made it. <laughs> Great driving, Christian. But if you guys subscribe to my channel, I would be very surprised if you hadn't heard of Rock Pirates but RC by now. <laughs> These guys are awesome. They've supported every RC crawling competition I've done to date. And I really appreciate the help and it's always fun to go out and wheel with these guys. I'll take the bypass, we'll go the next one. Well, I'm surprised you didn't make it because that means I'd have to try it again. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have seen me do this before, so we're going to watch the Rock Pirates run it. And don't let me stop you. If you need to get up close to it, see what's going on, go for it. Good, smooth, slow crawl. God, I wish I paid attention when you were driving. <laughs> there you go. It's time to change the oil. That's the line. Keep it going. That's wild, man. Keep that rear up. Keep the rear up. Nice. Pearl just one shot of that. Didn't even back up once. Good driving yeah. there. That was it. Nice, <laughs> SCX 10-3 base camp. Wheels and tires. You guys are big fans of running weights in your truck, right? Yep. All right. Any of the rock parts trucks you pick up, they've got some heft to them. Not too much. Usually around seven pounds or so. Usually around seven pounds, Steve says. Give or, give or take a half. 
Oh, oh. No, oh. she's fucking in. There you go. There you go. Good recovery. There it is. Now bring it all back up. That's it. That's it. Here she comes. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, oh. I would back up a little more, turn the direction you are. Yep, right there, and then come back forward. That's it. Back passenger just a touch. No, you gotta go driver on. Keep coming forward, driver. Tough. Good effort. He needs driver mod. <laughs> My base camp did not even come close. So. <laughs> Here comes the captain. That's a cool paint job. I like the silver trim around the windshield and all that. Custom front bumper. Custom rear bumper too. So Steve, what are some of your electronics you're running in this truck? Uh, I'm running uh, the uh, Spectrum. What's the name of the system, Connor? You know all the details. The right? Firma brushless crawler system, not the tune one, but the regular one. The censored combo. Yeah, yeah. And then what servo do you like? Uh, on this truck and most of my trucks, I'm running the Reef servos. Okay. And this one is a. Uh, uh, this is the RAW 500. Very nice. So it's probably fast then. And I think Davy Jones has my 777 in it. So. Very cool. And then I just picked up the new Reeves uh, 1100. Ooh. And um, I'm going to install that in my next build, which will be uh, the new base camp. Building yourself a base camp then, huh? Base camp, yeah. Very cool. That's it. That's it. Good line. And then just drive all the way to the camera. Just bring it on up. Yep. Say hi. Yep. And out the top it goes. Smooth and controlled. Very good work. Here we are, favorite obstacle in mouse trap. Run it through with my truck real quick, and then we'll get some footage of these guys getting in here. She was. Don't, I've driven this a few times though, guys. Don't worry. <laughs> now is it possible with narrower axle? Yes. Driven lots of things through it. Got the turn perfect. Getting faxes on the trail. No. <laughs> there it is. Super fun. It cycles the suspension both ways on your way in. 
And then the worst part is this little crack your front tires are coming off of. When the rears hit that, that's where it will either flip you or you're going to make it. See what happens, I think it might pull up. Most of the time they do. Yep, I'd come driver as much as you could. But you're pretty pinched in there at the moment. Working the steering while a little bit of throttle. Good work. Ah, <laughs> lost the rear. Yep, you gotta be careful from at this point. Me. You can break your truck pretty easy. <laughs> so I'll tell you what, Steve, Try and get your axle a little more level as you come around the corner. Front or rear? The rear. Okay. This is like a perfect obstacle for the face kit. All right. <laughs> Man, everything's are looking so good, too. All the help the sun is coming straight. <laughs> it's cool lighting. This has also got the Rock Pirates new element servo tray, servo winch tray, and battery tray in there. Those are really pretty parts these guys are making. What series aluminum is it? The high tech stuff that we can't talk about. Okay, sweet. <laughs> you're on the right line, your rear axle looks much better. Your truck's a lot more level. Hold it where you're at, keep going. I can hear the fan that this truck's working hard. That's it, right there. Yep, let that front pop up, if it will. I wouldn't even turn into it, just keep driving and your tire will pull it up. Maybe turn a little driver. Here she is, there she is, there she is. That's the line. It's gonna do it. And you just gotta Which chase this. Which way should we be going now, Logan? Left driver or passenger? I think you're good. Uh, go a little passenger. The yep, just to help carry that rear tire into the wall. Yeah. Oh, this is not a friendly place to stand. Yep, just keep it balanced. The rear's gonna pop up. Oh, there it comes. Yep, and I usually turn a little driver as that rear comes up and then just follow it out. That was it. I can't see their side though. <laughs> it's pretty much straight. Keep coming, keep coming. Yep. Insane. There you go. Insanely cool. That was cool. Great job too. That was ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. It's good to see other people in here hiking through here because this is what I'm doing, but you never see me hiking through it. That's why I'm always falling in these clips. <laughs> There's nowhere to stand. Yep, and then pretty much you can follow that wall on the driver's side as far as you want. Yep. Perfect. Steve conquered it. Good work, dude. Let me get out of the way so the rest of the guys can have some fun. Okay, sounds awesome. Good work. We got Connor working his way through. As mentioned, this has stock electronics, so we're a little concerned about the servo being able to maneuver when it needs to. That's it. Base camp always dragging the bed. The other thing about this obstacle is the passenger tire being underneath that ledge and still holding and, and letting you, you know, pass through still. Yeah, it's pretty wild. You, you almost just drive straight and the tire has nowhere to go but to let it come up. Just like that. Driver, driver. A little less driver, but. <laughs> the key is your <laughs> so focus on keeping that rear axle as level as possible so come through a little driver yep and then turn into it follow the wall right there that's it right there and then turn a little passenger to bring that front up straight come forward if it will it's working hard that's it Now it's gonna lose it. Oh! Yeah. Oh. There it is. Oh, that's 
passenger? Yes. Hold it there. And then back driver. Yep, just kind of straight. A little more driver. A little more driver. I'm trying. <laughs> the truck is trying. I'm impressed with the base camp. It's putting in work right now. Straight. Driver. Gonna come through. My feet are in the way. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there it was. <laughs> Popped out the other side. Yeah, the turn is very, also very tricky. There it is. There it is. There it is. You're using the bed as a pivot. Yep. Got some. Got some dig. <laughs> And the base camp pulls through. Stock yeah. electronics. No way. <laughs> I thought for sure that servo was going out. Took dude. some work, but made it through mousetrap. Heck yeah, dude. We also heard something go crunch on the previous obstacle off camera, so we'll find out if something else is wrong in this truck. <laughs> yeah, real quick. Okay, work on going a little driver to get the rear axle leveled. Yep, just like that, and then back into the wall. Yep, yep, yep. Passenger. Oh, a little late on the passenger. Oh. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take a hard reset on that. <laughs> I think it's differential. Yeah, it's gotta be something I ask you. Have a little bit left right there. I'm not gonna break my truck out there. I don't need a backup truck. <laughs> it's the pearl, I ain't gonna break. <laughs> Gotta love the banter at these guys. Yep. 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 Hold it in the wall. Yep. A little more on the wall. A little more. There it comes. Hold it in the wall. Oh. And then back driver. Driver. That's it. Let's drop the axle right where we needed it. There it is. Oh. The rear went back all the way up again. Let's see if it'll take it. Oh. Nice about as extreme as you can get on that angle without not making it. Nope, come forward right there. That rear tire got all sidewalled in there. Keep going. Uh, no, no, keep coming. Oh, man. <laughs> so close, we had it. Uh. Dude, you, you, your wheel position has to be like on, on point. You can't make a single mistake. That's why I was saying that when I came through here, I hit every mark I was looking for. <laughs> I just can't believe that passenger front pops up over that ledge. Right. That is absolutely insane. Yep, right there, right there. Hold Watch it. That driver, right. hold the driver. Hold the driver. Yep, and then keep the front level yep passenger it's gonna bring it back up it's gonna burn out here in a second more passenger there it was very nice we got the corner Two tires for a second. That was it right there. There we go. Up and out of crack number two. Black Pearl got it. Great driving. Yeah. Good work. The ditch held up. <laughs> I don't know if I could say that, but they made it out the other side. <laughs> Got the big wall. Not 
Oh, and it's sandy today. There she is, there she is. Very nice, it got out. Yep, and you can crawl from there. Sweet, it's not easy. Oh, right there. So close, it's like one inch away. Here, the tires howling on that. Yeah. Oh, it died! No! <laughs> Lipo. Is that your second battery? Just took my battery. All right. All right, that's spicy enough. I think it's not going to be a problem. You're running a fusion? Oh, that was it. To get it. <laughs> Gotta make the truck look good. There it goes. That's it, man. Later, boys. I'm out. You just got a crack from here. You're good. Yeah. All right. I don't think the pirate wagon's getting here today. We'll find out. Oh, dude, you have it, dude, unless you break your truck before. <laughs> All right. Well, I'll take the bypass. I can get it any other day. These guys are only here today. Needs more spice. <laughs> there she is. All right. Base camp up and out. <laughs> so this canyon really benefits narrow trucks. So I think all of you guys are going to be fine. If you're wide, it locks your wheels into the little ledges and stuff, and it's. It's real tough to get out of here, but not a problem right there. Nice and easy. And out the drop, out of mousetrap. And here's the pearl, made every obstacle in here. There you go. Way to go. Rock Pirates, Black Pearl, ate it up. You're good, just come on forward. Very nice. And here comes the base camp. Just let gravity do its work. It, it'll handle it. <laughs> and there's my pirate wagon after a rough little canyon stretch out the other side. Well, guys, thanks for coming out and wheeling with me. I greatly appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed the uh, trail here. So, thanks so much for coming out and all the support. You guys will be seeing rock pirates in future videos. That's no doubt. We'll see you guys in the next one. Keep the rubber side down.